Um, as you all know, we, uh, we wait until uh, people have uh, finished their active service at other clubs before we bestow them with honours at the Collingwood Football Club because we like to see it as a way of embracing people coming back to our club. Once you're a Collingwood person, you're a Collingwood person forever. So our next life member, after having a little bit of a spell elsewhere, is back at the club and his name is Chris Dawes. <laughs> Dawesy was a sensational power forward in our 2010 and 2011 seasons. With Travis Cloak and Lee Brown, he formed the dominant forward line that took us to our Premiership glory. Chris was one of five Magpies to kick two goals in the second grand final. I tell you, it took him to a career high of 30 for the season in a Premiership year. He also kicked three goals in that uh, amazing preliminary final in 2011 when we fixed up Hawthorne. He came to the Pies, picked number 28 in the national draft. He made his debut against St Kilda in 2008. He played 71 games for the Pies, kicked 83 goals, was a member of the pre-season Premiership side in 2011, the NAB Cup, and of course a member of the Collingwood Premiership side in 2010. Like Alan Tuvey, he has been exemplary in the way he's carried himself on and off the ground. He's uh, well loved by not only the supporters but his teammates and we regard these two guys in particular as two of the finest products of our football club. So again, if we look to the monitors now, let's relive some of the great times of Chris Dawes. We feel I'll be arguing over tonight. Oh, Dawes from stage left has taken an unbelievable mark. It's down there. Dawes, that'll do. Chris Dawes has put in a couple. Huge kick this one. It's on the way. And it splits the middle. Kicks the ball. I think it's McCorriter. And Dawes. Dawes with strength. Strong. There as well. And that is a beautiful kick. Sweetly off the boot for Dawes. Good last week. Starts brilliantly this afternoon. At the synchronised doors, his recovery is outstanding. And you can see what happened next. And he's looking to find a way through at the doors. And back down in the air. Doors! Oh, that is Dawson! Now, Brian was running outside. He goes to the front and doors is gone. This guy's been a very important part of all of that. Oh, how sweet it is. Uh, I guess, thank you. Um, I'm incredibly grateful, not just for this enormous honour, um, that, you know, by virtue of being a Premiership player, is something I'm incredibly proud of, um, but not something I've really, as a player, as, as Tu's mentioned, you don't reflect on that sort of thing, and even four or five months into my retirement, I still haven't really fully reflected on it, and so I think with that in mind, I think that'll be something that continues to grow in terms of the amount of satisfaction it gives me. Um, but I, I, I'd like it known how, how grateful I am, uh, not just for the award, but the opportunity to be a part of a club like Collingwood. Um, and, you know, I sort of, I understood where I sat in the scheme of things um, and, we, and, you know, just felt so lucky to be a part of such a good side we had through 2010, 2011, 2012. Um, so all I'm up here to do is to say thank you. I uh, never sort of got a chance at, at any footy club I'd been at to publicly thank various people. Um, so as a collective, I want to thank all the people involved at Collingwood Footy Club because I think the thing we all know about footy clubs is it's not you know, the name of the team or the colours you wear, it's the people involved that make it up. And I think that's why Collingwood's such a, a strong club because of um, you know, the fine people they employ both as players and as administrators and you know, Ed and, and your board, I think you're so well, well led. And then you know, as much as anything, it's the, the supporters of Collingwood. We know we're a different breed, but um, it, it's what makes you so proud to identify as a Collingwood person. Um, all, all the people, particularly in my time at the Pies, who I came in contact with, uh, thank you. And also to uh, my family, represented by my wife Paige, who's here with me tonight as well. Um, they were the support through, you know, definitely the highs of footy, but probably more so the lows. And so, um, and, and, and they do happen. It's, it's honours like being a premiership player that, that makes you put up with them. Um, and when things are good, everyone wants to know you. And when, and when they're not, it's people 
it's your family and, and people like Paige who pick up the pieces. So uh, publicly, thank you. And thank you very much. And if you'd like to relive it again, uh, Dorsey, more than welcome, come around to my place any night of the week if you want to <laughs> have a look through. And uh, by the way, you'll be able to see Dorsey in action playing for the Sorrento Sharks this year down in the Mornington Peninsula. So uh, good luck with uh, all that goes with uh, your, the rest of your career.